Hi there, my name is Carla Ann. I'm the car lady here at Highway Mazda and Steinbeck. And today I wanna to talk to you about your door locks. So as you know, your door, uh, doors on your vehicle can lock and unlock using your fob, but you also can adjust how the doors lock um, in your infotainment center, center. So let's take a look at that part first. So we start by looking at your center and we turn it over to, in, to the settings. We'll, we'll move the knob over sideways until we get to the vehicle tab. We'll scroll down to door locks and click. So first of all, it's talking about the auto door lock mode. So what the auto door lock mode is, is when the car will automatically lock to keep you safe while driving. So this is not when you leave the car, this is while you're in the car and while the car is driving, how is the car automatically gonna lock? So that's what the auto door locks is about. So let's talk about that now. So here you have, it's currently set at lock when driving. So that means that when you move your, um, your gear shift into drive and you already are registering a speed. So you have to be driving then the doors will automatically lock and you'll hear all of them click and these will all go forward to lock. This one is also marked right now that the doors will, you can come to a stop, you can put it in park and the doors will remain locked, but you will, when you turn the ignition off by pushing the start stop button here, uh, then the vehicle will unlock the doors. The, one, the most popular one that I find is the one up here, which is locking out of park and unlocking into park. So what that means is if you, if you pull this into drive, it's going to lock the car. And then when you put it back into park, it's going to unlock the car. So let's, I'm gonna be quiet now for a second and I'll put it into drive and I want you to listen for the clicking and I'll show you what happens here. So I'm gonna put it into drive, listen and it automatically locked the doors. All right, now I'm gonna put it back into park and watch what happens to the lock. It unlocks automatically. So that's what the auto door locks do. So the one that I currently have it set at is lock out of park and unlock in park. You can also just do it so that it's locking when you come out of park. So then this would lock. Now the doors are locked and if I put it back into park, they stay locked but that's actually okay if you don't have passengers. Because at this point, even though it's still locked, both front doors, so the passenger door and the driver door, can still open without having to unlock. So that is common one for people who don't very often have passengers with them. So that's the lock when it's shifting out of park, but it stays locked when you put it back into park. And now the lock when driving. This is again, once your speedometer is registering your speed and it does note that you are driving, it's going to automatically lock the vehicle. And then when you put it into park, it's going to unlock. And then like it was at the beginning, lock when driving. So again, once your, your speedometer registers speed, it will lock the doors. And then when you turn the ignition off is when it's going to unlock. Of course, you can choose that it's only locked when driving and that it stays locked when you stop. Of course, your front doors will be available to open without any issues. Or you can turn off the entire system, meaning that no matter what you do, the doors will not lock unless you hit the lock button here. All right. So that's how the auto door lock system works. I'm gonna put it up here, which is the most popular. And then we'll go back to the door lock mode here. If you have any questions about how your auto door lock mode works, please feel free to give me a call. My name is Carla Ann. I'm the car lady here at Highway Mazda in Steinbach. Have a super day.